So Kanye West just waltzed into Tokyo like a runway model on a caffeine high. And honestly, who needs a plane ticket to watch Fashion Week when you have him? I mean, really, he's like a human mood board with a penchant for drama. Ever seen someone channel lost panda cheek while strutting through a bustling city? The man makes clashing styles look like haute couture. Is this what they mean by urban jungle? Because I'm here for it. And then there's Bianca Sensori, his perfect partner in crime, sporting a haircut that screams, I'm edgy, but I'm also on a budget and ready for instant ramen. They say opposites attract, but this couple is like a high concept art installation that even the most sophisticated art critic struggles to comprehend. It leaves us wondering, does she cut her hair with kitchen scissors or is there a stylist somewhere pulling their hair out? Who knows? Meanwhile, Tokyo is just living its best life as the backdrop for this circus. I can just imagine the locals whispering among themselves, look, there's Kanye, get the camera ready. This is gonna be legendary. It's like having the Super Bowl of fashion right in the middle of your Tuesday afternoon. Forget the cherry blossoms, the real bloom is seeing how street style and Kanye collide in a city known for its trends. Bravo, Tokyo. Every snapshot needs to tell a story, right? So here we have Kanye pulling the ultimate power move, both a haircut and a girlfriend reveal. What a combo. It's almost as if he woke up one day and thought, I realize I might be outshined, so let's make sure I'm center stage at all times. Forget the main character energy. This is more like the entire cast of a Broadway show trying to steal the spotlight. Talk about overachieving. Now I can picture them discussing their next wild style adventure over sushi. Bianca, love, what's next? Shall we try wearing matching bathrobes to meet the emperor? And Bianca's probably over there like, why not? Maybe throw in some flip-flops to really cement our status as the Kardashians of Tokyo. Meanwhile, the sushi chef is quietly contemplating how to enhance his own fashion game, possibly trading rice for sequins. Listen, Kanye and Bianca living their best lives is the kind of news we didn't know we needed. It's like a weird blend of fairy tale and fever dream. What's next? A vlog series of them exploring vending machines while critiquing their choices as if they were Michelin star meals? It's all just a little surreal, isn't it? Is this how the rest of us should plan our trips while dressed as if we're the main attractions in a bizarre carnival? And now I ask you, dear audience, if you found yourself in Tokyo with Kanye as your fashion guru, would you embrace the wild ride of style evolution or instantly look for the nearest exit? Because let's face it, either you rise to the occasion as avant-garde royalty or you hop on the nearest flight home. A real life, choose your own adventure, replaced with a choose your own catastrophe. What's your move? Like and subscribe, please.